Alright guys, welcome back to some more Pokemon X and Y Soul Link Nuzlocke. Um, so I believe when we last left off, I would found the town and Nitz had wandered off down the route and started fighting trainers because he went the wrong way. Yep. Also, I got tons of loot. I'm getting like presents stacking up on presents in that screen. Oh, I need to actually connect, don't I? Oh, boo. Might not be a bad idea. Alright, I'm going to loot the town first. I think that's my first order of business and I'll go check out your route. A Pokemon <laughs> trainer with a great Ampharos in Azure Bay. Well, uh, someone in that town has the fishing rod. And you can fish while on uh, Pokemon deck. Ooh, there's an incense seller. I don't know if you knew about that. Okay, who do I have in my team? Because I can buff moves now. Oh my god, it takes forever to connect to the internet. Okay, so items that these guys have. Janeway is on leftovers, which I kind of want to leave. Uh, Ramoth is Eviolite, which is also not bad, considering it's only a first form. I don't think any of the incense is buff dragon anyway. Skidoo. I need to go for a ride. Eee. Yeah, so all I could do was see incense, which would buff the water-type moves on Lapras, but Lapras is actually pretty fine. <laughs> It's nice still... chesto berries on the table with a sign saying help yourself. Oh, you take oh, chesto berry. Sure. I don't remember this hollow clip. Like to give a tip. Well, I did get a berry out of it, so they get a hundred bucks. Oh god, the rival wants to fight us in front of the gym. So be away from the gym, I guess. Yeah, um, shit, who do I have up front? Oh, I got Lapras up front. Let me throw Ramoth. Why is Ramoth not healed? This is not good. Wait, Ampharos in the... I don't what? know what that's referencing. Yeah, uh, Mega Ampharos. Ah. Ooh, I got a Silk Scarf. Trainer. Oh. That's gotta be painful. You know what a Silk Scarf is for, right? It boosts normal type moves. Ah. That would have been perfect for your skitty. Yeah, well, you have, like, three normals in your party right now, don't you? Yep. I think they're all holding something. It's actually not bad. I can throw it on, uh, Picard. I don't even know. Because he's, cur he's currently got the almost perfect happiness from what I think. So, I mean, the return is the most powerful thing we could possibly have. I mean, that's already 150 power. Ooh... That's a lot of incenses. Yeah, that's I didn't even than buffing aerial ace. Honestly, I'm gonna do that. <gasps> Ooh, the fishing fanatic. I found the good rod. Oh, nice. He's right next to the incense perk guy. If I lose my ability to do super effective moves, but now I have. Like, what's the Silk Scarf? Another 50% or something? 40%? I don't know. So basically, I have like 180 power normal type move now. Oh. Yes, I'll take a good rod. Wait. Yay! Seaside Station, take the monorail here to the Pokemon Center and the Pokemon Gym. Oh, that's evil. Uh, I heard electricity for Lumio City is getting lower than usual. Oh, so there's a mystery at the power plant. Oh god, there's a hotel here. But it's both good and bad. Take the monorail here to the Pokemon Center and Pokemon Gym. So do we want to take the monorail or no? Not yet. Wait. My Magikarp is so cute when it eats Poke Puffs with gusto. Watching it eat them made me go off my diet. Wow. Meryl! You got one of them. Oh, hotel. Bring a Pokemon with you that you're really friendly with. Well, since I had Gengar since level 1, I'm pretty sure I'm friendly with him. Some gang of goons calling themselves as Team Flare is out <gasps> causing ruckus. Lucky Egg! Oh, yes. I don't know if that stacks the EXP share in this one or not. It does. Bring a Pokemon with, that you're really friendly with, and I'll give you something nice. Well... That's who gives it to you. Oh god, it's Mr. Bond. Oh wait, no Mr. Bonding. Nice, that'll make training wait. a lot easier. 
Hello, I am the game director. What? Oh, the guy who helped direct the game I stuck himself in a hotel? Apparently, if you fill up your Pokedex, he gives you something. Yeah, well, we're on those lock runs, so <laughs> he's kind of screwed. But it's loot. How can they deny us this loot? What town has a hot spring next to the Pokemon Center? That's the volcano one. If you give uh, me a correct answer, I'll give you a TM. Do you want to try the quiz? Sure. Here's the question. What's the move that I'm describing? If the user is not holding an item, this... Oh, acrobatics. Ding. Wow. Hope I get an easy one like that. I'll probably get some weird one that's like a Gen 6 move or something. Ooh, acrobatics is a good... Uh, right there on the cliff to the left of the hotel. Ah, all right. What's the move I'm describing? Target makes us lose its ability to concentrate. Makes the target lose its ability to concentrate and lowers the target's special attack stat. Oh, don't know. Trick room, confide, acrobatics, embargo. Now, embargo it, is it's item. Con uh, it's confide. Okay, I figured it was either trick... Trick room was the switching attack... Uh, or slow Pokemon go faster. Yeah. All right. Uh, oh, I got TM100 confide. Great. We're going to have to collect them all from this person. Yep. I got so acrobatics. I got acrobatics the better of the deal. Better. Yeah, fuck confide. I'm, gonna um, that. I'm going to go ahead and surf up and catch a Pokemon on that route with the rod. Um, Are we in the town yet or no? Uh, that is the town. So let's uh, fish off the pier first. We have our. Can we? So. Uh, they're not there, apparently. All they're... right, now it's time for me to take another key item and link it. Damn. Not there. Doesn't look like we could actually fish in this town. Ooh. Uh... Maybe in the next part of the town. Uh, do you want to take the monorail or go surfing first? Can we fish off the dock near the boats? Nope. Tried. Mom, mom's words echoed. I'll take the monorail. Maybe there's a spot there. Oh, and okay, the, once you get down to the beach, oh. you're actually out of the city. It's Professor Sycamore. Hey, you dick, I got a pro uh, bone to pick with you. <laughs> <laughs> well, we killed your Pokemon. Both of them. I see you finally obtained everything you need for Mega Evolution. A Mega Stone for the Pokemon and a Mega Reed for the trainer. You knew how it worked, you asshole! <laughs> Sending us on this <laughs> fool's errand. And a strong bond with your Pokemon. A strong bond? It's only a hypothesis, but I think the bond between Pokemon and Trainer is the key to this new evolution. Except well, how it, are you it, testing this? Where's your control group? Except it's not doing? a strong You're bond. You're a terrible professor. Where did you get your P <laughs> Where is the Pokemon? Where do they give people PhDs in the Pokemon universe? But, obviously, these people are idiots. It's obviously not a strong bond either. Because that Lucario Mega evolved for us and we just met him. But what we is this bond? Off the stuff that we actually had bonded with. So, I mean... <laughs> and why are there examples of mega evolution only in the Kalos region? There's still so much we don't know. Because people they did not want to rank on it. <laughs> the more you know, the more there is to research. And if you're such a terrible researcher, you have a lifetime ahead of you of research. <laughs> Does this make you think of the legendary Pokemon found only here in the Kalos region? Nowhere else? Maybe that's not a coincidence. <laughs> hey, we got the fly. <laughs> oh, what an excellent point indeed. Wait, you found fly? Yeah, he gives it to you at the end. Oh, okay. The more you know. Okay. I'm always trying to forge a bond between myself and the character I'm playing. If all I think about is how I'm nothing like a character, then I'll just hate playing it. Focus on what I have in common with the character, put myself in her shoes, I might be able to understand her. E, it's almost like she's let's playing. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, okay, apparently the next time we see her, she wants to battle. Um, One yeah. day I'll find trash can loot. One day. <laughs> oh, never mind. I'm just battling. Hmm. Okay, I'll fight so, you. Uh, I like the girl in the black shirt by the door. Tee -hee, the movie even... star Deantha rides the monorail. Visitors always have a one-track mind about it. And then read the second part of it. How's that for a one-liner? Oh, it's a pun in the pun. Oh. Will you be riding the monorail, not today. I said yes. Okay. I wanted to see so if we can go fish. When we're done with the city, we're going to fly back to the other cities we can go fishing at. That we did. Oh. 
remember no, that. No surfing. There's no fishing at those towns either. Really? Yep. Which do you think is cooler, Pokemon What's or Mono? What's the point of getting the rod? Uh, we can. Ooh, I got metronome. We can ooh, fish in Azure good. Bay. Mm, it, Spamming no. a move will make it stronger. No, not the item. Wait, was that the item? I don't yeah, know. that was the held item. That's the spam a move and it gets stronger. You put that on and you put that power up punch on a Pokemon. If I had a fighting <laughs> type, like that's a good combo. Are you there? Do you know of Dr. Fennel? She made the amazing system, the game sync. Yeah, she's from... Oh, it's so cute. I think this little girl has a Meowth uh, plushie. This other one might have a Pikachu plushie? Or is that an Electrike? I think they're... Let me go check. I think I know which ones you're talking about. Are they Jolteon plushies? It's hard to tell. They're like six pixels wide. Okay, now I think I'm it's... lost. I think those are actually Pikachu or Pichu. It might be Pichu, that makes sense. It's like the ears are a little bit more separated than they would be for a Pikachu. Then again, it is only six pixels. <laughs> also, it's a plushie. Yeah. Pokemon right, Ears you. Ooh, two shopkeepers, come on! Oh god, it's him! Well, repeat balls are useless. <gasps> oh! Pokemon in Horde battles can have hidden abilities. No, I don't need explanations about O powers. Ooh. That's not a bad power. That one I think we should allow ourselves to use. Hmm. Increased friendship gain on Pokemon. Eh. Let's stay with the no O powers rule just to make it simpler. Although if we ever find that EXP one, we can turn that one on only when off camera grinding. Because I hate grinding. Ooh, Max Repels are for sale now. Ultra Balls. Yes. I'll buy 10 of those. those. 15 of them. I hate how they don't give you uh The other guy also sells uh, quick balls and timer balls. So you can huck the quick ball first turn if it's not something threatening to you. <clears throat> I'm buying some extra pills too. Uh, I'll save my money. Well, I want to see if... You met a Helioptile on Route 13. Mm, that's, we haven't been there yet. Well, I have a Helioptile from the other route. Having you know, lots Dr. of Dr. Fennel from Unova region. Created an amazing system called Game Sync. What? Carrying a Pokemon uh, Dream when they're tucked in with the Game Sync. Oh, is this one of those like carry it around and Pokey Walker things? No, Game Sync is the uh trading and whatnot from black and white. Oh. Pokemon with abilities like Insomnia and Vital Spirit won't fall asleep for you. Why do they have two moves that do that? Does Vital Spirit do something else? Wait, what? So those egg-like things that are found at the Pokemon Daycare. Strictly speaking, they're not eggs. They're more like a Pokemon Cradle. What? They don't understand sex at all. You mean the thing that has been labeled in all generations as Pokemon Eggs. Having lots of Pokemiles will give you a big smile. Okay, this Furfro just said gee hee hee. <laughs> the dog. Interesting. That's how um, Gajil from Fairy Tale laughs. Sharing treats, having fights, things that can only only seem to cause a loss can't be done. Oh alone. God, no. Is there going to be a triple battle soon? Oh god, no. I just Hold played... Alright, top three Pokemon. Shit, Janeway can't use Surf in a triple battle. Oh, thanks, game. Mimic a sound for me when I can't hear it. Um, Gengar. Oh, it was Beedrill. If I guess... Here... I can't hear my sounds, Gengar. Dude, I'm gonna keep guessing until I get Gengar to pop up. <laughs> <laughs> B 
Oh, really? She went back to Beedrill. And now three Pokemon at once and both triple and... Oh, wait, they got rotation battles too again? Okay. Beedrill. I hate you right now, game. Name of my song. Loudred. Gengar. Come on! It's done like everyone except Diggers being Gengar. Aha! That's it. All that worked for that. Um, that sounded like Alexam. Nope. Oh, that was Pidgeotto. All right, try again. At least you can hear yours. <coughs> oh shit. That one sounds Lapras. Aha! Pokey toy. Oh god, yes. Can I get more, please? <laughs> Oh, if you it's go south, anti Wobbuffet. If you go south, you get a black sludge. Um, that was Axiom. Okay, I'm not leaving town to route the. Ah, you can only get one Pokey toy. <laughs> I wish it would open it up so you can get a whole bunch of them, because those things are honestly going to save us from Wobbuffets forever. What's to the south? Uh, if you go to, into the exit, but, you know, the little in-between area between routes. Ah, that little tunnel. Yeah. It's kind of a nifty thing, because it lets them load a route while you're not on the route. It's kind of huh. a little idea. I got Black Sludge. Who do I want? I'm going to give it to the Gengar, probably. <gasps> Actually. <I'm... laughs> what? What happened? Black Sludge is leftovers for poison types. Oh, yeah. And I got a Beedrill, so I put it on Beedrill. Have... Mimi has a poison typing. Oh, I guess you're going to go uh, Vileplume. Yeah, I want to go Vileplume, but I don't have a... Uh... Uh, Leaf Stone. Leaf Stone, yeah. All right, so we can't fish in this town. So I guess we'll go surf up to that one route and then fish there. So you are you used sure there was no earlier city that we could have fished in? Yes. Now that we have the good rod, I know we, there was some we couldn't because we only had the old rod and they were just magic arps. We surfed there instead. Except for we didn't go back to the other town, like the, the one town with the lake and the river. Like, there's two towns with water. No, there's only one you can actually... Because we went to Ambret Town and we got... That's where we got our fossils from. Uh, the Silage City, the one with the bike route, we surfed there. There's nothing at Geosenge, Shalur. You know, as much as I hate to get rid of Twister because it keeps getting me berries off of trees, I think it's time for me to teach to move. I'm going to fly back because I'm pretty damn certain we can fish off those towns. There's nothing we can fish in. But since I got first walk, I guess I'll walk on to the... Route, anyways. You don't have a Pokemon on your party that can learn fly, anyway. Nope. <laughs> because someone keeps killing them off. Gee, I wonder who that could be. Certainly not me. <laughs> Alright, Picard. Warp Just speed. Just out of curiosity, nope, not a single one can learn to fly. I hate you, game. What? We don't have the fly badge. Ha! Well, guess we're, you're going surfing here too, huh? Or there's this cave up here. That's the gym. Oh. I think. I'm pretty sure, at least. Use rain dance to make it rain, thunder will never miss. Yep. Oh, shit. Rival battle? God damn it. Since I'm a Pokemon trainer, I want to know things <laughs> that make Pokemon special. Well, while you do that, I'm going to go ahead and take the good rod and surf up to there. Got three Pokemon. Oh, he's got this Meow Stick again. Now, what typing is that thing? Psychic? 
Uh, Meowstic is psychic. Oh, I fished and got something. Let's see what I get. Well, I did give Picard a silk scarf, so let's see how well it handles a, uh... Hmm. God damn it, fake out. I got a Remoraid. Oh, that thing looks creepy as shit when it's Psy- Oh my god, Psy Beam hits hard. I can tank one more Psy Beam. Hmm. So let's see, Remoraid. Let's use the net ball. Yep, water type. Light screen is special defense. That's perfectly fine. I'm just going to punch in the face again. Wow, I just got a critical capture. Nice. So what'd you catch? Uh, Remoraid. Hmm, not a bad one. And then it'll pair with whatever you have. It's probably going to be a guy, isn't it? Ooh, Janeway wants Ice Beam. Yes, please. Um, goodbye, Rain Dance, I guess. All right. <laughs> uh, I've been going Undertale a lot lately, but I can't help it for this one. I to send in an Absol. What do I have that can kill an Absol? Now, Absol has mostly dark moves. Yep. I'll go fight her now. After. Um, what else does the Absol have? It has that nasty cut. I can't go Lucy. I could go Janeway and just surf it to death. I don't think it'd have fighting moves, right? Um, Absol? I don't think so, unless double kick. Yeah, but double kick's pretty weak. And Janeway actually has the leftover, so I should be able to tank any bullshit this guy tries throwing at me. I hate his Absol. Passion. Oh, oh yeah, yours is a guy. Actually, I'm gonna see if I can freeze him with an ice beam. Huh, rap looks interesting. God, 30 damage with that slash, even against a Lapras. Wow. An ice beam is not doing all that much. I guess it is a weaker move. I should only use it for super effective times. I'm body slam. Body Slam is actually a really high power move and it has a really Is Ice Beam weaker than Surf? Come on, paralyze him. God, Janeway's taking a beating no. even with Ice the Beam's way. the same power as uh, Surf. I'd recommend using Ice Beam over Surf. Because you can get the freeze. Mm, no, Ice Beam's a 60 power. Uh, 90 no, I just checked. They're both 90. Ever seen Ice Beam at 90? Fucking hell, it's 90. Alright. <laughs> Ow, he crit me. Did Down we... to 47 HP. Good thing this is gonna kill him. Don't lose our Lapras. I don't want to lose my awesome surfing Pokemon. Especially considering I have leftovers on, which is the only healing held item we're allowing. Well, we'll and Black Sludge and whatnot. Yeah. Berries and stuff, not allowed. What does Telekinesis do? I've never... Okay. Makes the target float with its psychic power. Target is easier to hit for three turns. Holy... Would that be a bitch if it made it immune to ground types as well? Okay, so I the, just checked my Remoraid. Increased attack, decreased speed. It knows Psy Beam, Aurora Beam, Bubble Beam. Damn. Oh yeah, those are actually really good on the beams. I got that stupid tentacle. I have to send in Frogadier. Alright, I'm gonna heal up and then I'm gonna fight. Well, let's fight a frog with a monkey. Because that doesn't really have any, like, correlation or anything, but that's what we're doing. <laughs> uh, does Steel resist Dark? I'm pretty... uh, I don't think it does. Whoa. Okay, steals another typing I'm a little iffy on. <laughs> Can you show me Mega Evolution? No, I can't. You kind of killed my other one. Oh, wait. No, you didn't. Boy, did you miss out. I totally got a free Mega ev Evolving Pokemon on the last place. Yay, Ramoth grew to level 29. And the rival is dead. Yay. 
Oh wow, her meow stick's 31. Light screen, I think, is special. Yep. Boom! You have something I don't. I guess I'll have to think about that. Yes, all my Pokemon die, so I have extra determination not to let them die. <laughs> Ow! That did half my health. Try not to kill anything. As long as she doesn't crit, we're fine. Haha! -ha! She used a move I'm immune to. Wow. She disarming. Why are you allowed that? Disarming voice. Uh, Frisk has uh, vo uh, oh, noise proof. Sound, soundproof. Yeah. Let's see, Absol, huh? Dark type. So you went south for the route. Uh, north. I surfed up to Azure Bay. Oh, so take the mon monorail back. Yes. I didn't want to go out to a new south also, route. there's trainers and shit over there that I haven't even touched. Let's see. I honestly should give Bunnel Diggersby the uh, Silk Scarf, but it, the pickup ability is nice, because I can get rare candies, and at higher levels I can actually get, uh, what is it called? Uh, rare, uh, leftovers, so each one of my team could have a leftover. Well, just put it on before important fights. Oh wow, I just two shot that Absol. I'm glad everything's easy for you. <laughs> My right, Gengar. So we, to, we need to encounter it in the water? Uh, yeah. So if you go up, you can... Uh, you'll see the drop down for Azure Bay. All and right. then you can either surf to try and get yourself a Mantine or Mantike, whatever it's called. Or you can just straight up go for the fishing and hope to get something good. I haven't hit the bay yet, so this doesn't count. Oh, Tentacool. I have one of those anyways. I just one-shot the Quilladin. <laughs> I don't feel like messing with Pokemon that have poison. <laughs> Dang it, why well, am I... All right, let's sign flip down just as we enter this battle, so this one counts. And it's Tentacool. So that don't count. <laughs> you have one? Yeah. Thank you, Duplicates Claws! Huzzah. <laughs> oh, couldn't get away, and it used Wrap. God damn it. Which means you won't be able to get away now. That's yeah, fine, the Wrap does two damage a turn, and I heal more than that, so... Well, I just kind of wrecked my rival. Okay, so the move Wrap itself did two damage, but the actual Wrap effect does more. Yep. Um, I guess I'm just gonna Body Slam it. Well, good luck. Okay. Why can't you use Water Gun or something? They heal me. I do not remember this, Jim. Like, at all. <coughs> hmm. Alright. I think I want to... Oh, don't you Toxic Spikes me. That's better. Ooh, Wayne leveled up. Let's see. Repeat right. balls are completely useless to us. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's what I said when I was looking through. I'm like, yeah, um, yeah, we can't do that. <coughs> Dang it. <laughs> All right. So, do I want to fish or not? What'd you get? How'd you get yours? I fished. Uh, the only thing you can come across while surfing up there is Tentacruel, or Tentacool, Lapras, and Mantines, or Mantines, okay, whatever it is. Okay, fishing, I have a bigger variety. Yes. Fishing off of Lapras' back, that's so cool that you can see that. I like how you can actually fish off their back. Alright, here we go. First encounter is... Damn it. Remote Ram Raid. Nice. I'm going to double check and make sure that you can actually fish for something before I waste everyone's time. So if you guys wouldn't mind giving me a second. I like how I'm like leaning precariously off Lapras's neck. 
Now, can you fish in the same spot without moving and just fail and then succeed? What do you mean? Like, if it says nothing seems to be biting. Oh, yeah. Just keep okay. going. I don't want to. I don't want to be surfing around and getting in. And if you have a way. horde ability, you might be able to encounter a horde of like slowpoke. Or well, I have a slowpoke, so you can't get that. So wingle. Um. Well, I already have ducklets. So, I mean, that's the same as a wingle. Uh, you can catch using a good rod, remoraid, and chinchow. Hell's yes! I need an electric chinchow. Yes, please. Well, we know what I Ghost is going to be. Lapras is probably not the best thing to have out in front. So let me actually switch over to Wayne. Or you can use the old rod, catch a love disc, and then when we find that trainer that trades for a Steelix, you can trade for that. Ooh. Ooh, a Steelix would be kind of cool. You're guaranteed to get a love disc here with an old rod. I... <sighs> But chin chows are so good. Well, actually, I, they're not. They're not horrible. Water, but electric. Electric water is a good type. Right? But you can't throw them out against ground types is the problem. Yeah, but they're good against other water types. They usually have water absorbed. I don't know. What do you think? What do you think? I think there's a chance you might not come across the Steelix Trader the whole time we're playing since it's... No, he's not in hotel. Yeah, he is. I think. Not a hundred percent. No, he's, he's like three, four towns back. He's like a passive guy right there at the side. Like he's in like a pokey center. Okay, well then, there you go. I have never, in all my time playing every Pokemon game, I don't think I've ever, ever had a Steelix, or have I? Crit? <laughs> How's Steel versus Fairy stack up? Uh, Steel's super um, effective against Fairy. Ghost, you have never had a Steelix, you tried it, died. Before you got it to Steelix. Alright. If I remember it correctly. Unfortunately, you won't be able to rename the Steelix. Mm. So you're stuck with whatever name it is. Give it a name for, on the love disc and then just we'll call it that. I don't know what gender it's going to be, so. Oh, yeah, true. Mm. Kind of makes me want to grab the chin chat, then. No. But Steelix is... I, I need a, I don't have anything that is good against Fairy. And that is one of my biggest weaknesses right now. So let's see if we can get one. A chin show? Or... Here's what I'll do. I'm going to alternate. I'm going to use each of the rods once, and just alternate back and forth, and I'll let luck and chance decide. Well, love disc is guaranteed on the old rod. <laughs> Right, but it's whether I'll get a Chin Chow first or the Love Disc. Because I can get a failure. Oh, true. So we're just letting luck decide. And luck has declared... I didn't remember which Rob this was. It's a Love Disc. <laughs> I think after this episode, we'll go and look it up for you so you can figure out where to get that Steelix set. See if a quick ball is actually useful or not. It's a uh, super easy catch, so... And there's a chance that Love Disc actually has an item on it. Oh yeah, Heart Scale. Love Disc's data and add to the Pokedex. Rendezvous Pokemon. It lives in warm seas, so to be... But a couple finding this Pokemon will be blessed with eternal love. So all they need is an old rod, and then they're guaranteed to find it. <laughs> all right, it's a male love disc. Um, mm. Well, you are going to be trading it, so. Yeah, I, I just need a throwaway male name. Wasn't there a heart in Adventure Time? Um, and it was male. Crit? Ricardio. His All right. Ricardio. I'll double check that. Yeah, because it, it, it's the heart pun. Yep, yeah, Ricardio. Just want to make sure. All right, we have Ricardio. And Adventure Time has... No uh, ultim and time There's travel. Also time travel. It has everything. Don't worry. All right. So there we go. We got Ricardio. It will instantly get traded away because... It's a love disc. <laughs> 
All right. So you want to go That's ahead done and... with that. Do we want to go to the other route, or... I say take it out here and we'll leave the other route of mystery. Or do you want to do the oh, other route? for the end of the episode. Yep. All right, let me teleport back to the Pokemon Center real quick so I don't have to swim all the way back. Oh, that's so cool when you teleport when you're on Lapras. Lapras spins around in a circle. <laughs> all right, if you want to wrap uh, it up. Are you, are you saying you'd leave your Lapras in the ocean? <laughs> no, it comes with. It just spins around with you. Like, when you yeah. normally do this. It has to spin with you or it stays in the ocean. Anyways. All right, guys. Hope you guys have enjoyed. And if you have, please leave a like and comment down below. Ghost and I both still need names. And, uh, yeah. Uh, if the, our, Down in this description is our links to each other's channel. So you can subscribe for more daily videos if you wish. And, yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. See ya.